Let's go scrolling with OBS Studio. All right, welcome back. Let's go ahead and fire up OBS Studio and see what we have here. So normally when I do the live events, I'll have at least two scenes here to the left and I can name one me or whatever that I want to. In this case, I named it me. And scene number two would be the Chromium web browser through the window capture. So let's go back to the first scene that I, that I labeled uh, me. And let's say I wanted to add some scrolling text here at the bottom. So I go to my sources application here or the sources box. I click the plus and uh, we want text which is right here. Okay so let's see and the one thing about this you want to have a fairly uh, longer sentence. For example if I just was to um, type in welcome okay and I go back to the text here and right click to filters plus I want scroll okay and let's say I wanted this to scroll but it seems kind of uh, silly just to have you know one word I need to expand this click and hold that with the mouse so as you can see here of course that's going too fast but yeah it would make sense just to have you know one word scrolling like that. So let's go back here, double click left, and we want um, we want to have more than just one word. So first of all, why don't we go ahead and uh, right click filters, go back to where we were, and let's go, go default and let's stop that for now before it makes me dizzy. Okay, so I want to add more than just the word welcome. It doesn't, there's nothing wrong with the word Welcome. Now, I could just leave the one word and set this not to scroll. Just leave it there as it is. So when I click transition, you would see this part on the right with the picture of me and the word welcome. But that's that's kind of it's kind of plain. It's kind of boring. So let's, you know, jazz it up a little bit. So let's go ahead and go back to this and uh, let's go ahead and keep welcome there. So I would say welcome period. And uh, this does not have to be in caps, so we'll do this. Welcome, period. And I like to have at least a couple spaces. And from here, you know, I can write anything that I want to. Um, let's see. Uh, welcome, join us on the next. And for this, I'll have the caps because the title of a show. Linux A Team uh, featuring the best uh, yeah featuring the best of the of the Linux community um, and then from there I, I can add something else if I want to and normally it would be uh, to uh, sponsor a live show uh, send email to I can add another space there. Now it would be total OS today one one at gmail.com and space space. And I can change the color of this. I can change the font. I think I'll leave the font the way it is. As you can see here, you have lots of choices. We can go bold. So and as far as color goes, I like to add a little bit of color. And usually around the uh, something around an orange-ish color which would be that to give it a nice gradient there and I mean I can also add another color there to give it another a color blend maybe yellow and um, if you want to so why don't we just leave that uh, the way it is I don't go to outline or drop shadow or anything else normally so I click OK now you can see here it's really big so I'm gonna drag this down a little bit and let's see yeah that's a fairly long sentence but that's just the way I want it when we are scrolling so I'm gonna drag that drag that top line and I think I'll just leave it the way it is there so now I want to go back so we're gonna go right click filters and I want this to scroll and we're gonna do vertical or horizontal it really it doesn't really make much to go vertical uh, at least I don't think so like you see there it kind of looks like a 
yeah it just doesn't look right so we'll do, we'll do horizontal and uh, I think that's probably the right speed right there so now when I hit transition you would go from seeing this to this and that's how you do simple scroll text in OBS studio once again you can make this as long or as short as you want it to be keep in mind if you just do one or two words you probably don't want it scrolling uh, you probably just want to leave it uh, stationary but that's entirely um, up to you and that's it that's how I do scrolling text when I do the live events here on the total OS today channel uh, if there's anything that I missed or anything that you would like to add uh, please let me know in the comments below that's it for this one I'll catch you on the next one take care